Welcome to the IntelliLearn video library, Converting Between Micrograms, Milligrams, Grams and Kilograms, Rules. When converting from one unit of mass to another unit of mass, you must identify the starting unit and the final unit you must change a quantity into. The rules are, if you are changing from a smaller unit to a larger unit, you must divide the starting quantity. Alternatively, if you are changing from a larger unit to a smaller unit, you must multiply the starting quantity. To clarify this, consider the units of mass ordered from smallest to largest as you move from left to right. Each unit is 1000 times larger than the unit immediately to its left. Let's start by showing three examples where a smaller unit is changed into a larger unit. If you are changing a quantity from micrograms to milligrams, you must divide the starting quantity by 1000, as the example shows. If you are changing a quantity from milligrams to grams, you must divide the starting quantity by 1000, as shown. And if you are changing a quantity from grams to kilograms, you must divide the starting quantity by 1000, as illustrated. In these last three examples, a quantity has been changed from a smaller unit into a larger unit. The information in the yellow box summarises the rule that was applied. Now let's consider three examples where a larger unit is changed into a smaller unit. If you are changing a quantity from kilograms to grams, you must multiply the starting quantity by 1000, as the example shows. If you are changing a quantity from grams to milligrams, you must multiply the starting quantity by 1000, as shown. And if you are changing a quantity from milligrams to micrograms, you must multiply the starting quantity by 1000, as illustrated. In these last three examples, a quantity has been changed from a larger unit into a smaller unit. The information in the yellow box summarises the rule that was applied. 